Okay, so Webflow have just launched a pretty cool feature called CMS on Canvas editing. What does that mean? Well, it means you can now edit content directly on the visual canvas, i.e. on the designer. And you can also spin up a new CMS page without leaving the designer. Interestingly, designer and visual canvas, using two words for the same thing there. Um, anyway, let's dive in and see what that actually means. So I've got this little project here called Webflow Things, just a list of things related to Webflow, lots of pretty cool stuff. Anyway, we have at the top of the list here, we have the Visual Div, which is a podcast hosted by two Webflowers from Ireland. And we want to change its name. We want to change the name to the MoFlow Guys podcast. Sorry about the voice there. And what we'd normally do is we'd click into the CMS. I know it's in resources, but you'd have to make sure that you know that it's in resources. Click on resources, find it. Now, you know, you might need to use the search. Click on the visual div, and then I'm going to go the Mo Flows. No, Mo Flow Guys podcast. And let's change the URL here. Okay, so I'm going to save. Yeah, save that one. Okay, so once I've got that, now I go back into. And yes, I can see it, it's been changed. But with a new feature of CMS editing on canvas, all I have to do is go here, the visual div, change it back to the visual div, I prefer that name. And you might think, okay, but what about the URL? Well, actually, when you're in here now, what you can do is if you go to settings, you can quickly click on this little icon here, and it launches a little modal that takes you basically into the same CMS view that you always have. It's just for that item. And we click and save it. In fact, we're just going to publish this as well. There you go. Easy, easy peasy. And then we want to go, okay, do you know what? Community just doesn't make sense. Um, it just doesn't do enough of it in explanation. So we want to change this. But I don't know where this is coming from. So what I could do is look at this and look, okay, it's from types. But instead, I could just go, boom, click on this and actually go in straight into that collection in the CMS. Pretty smart, hey? So yeah, lots of things you can do here. Um, you could, you know, if you're in, in here, you could go in and change things that you might want to in terms of, you know, resource type, for example. So we've got here that um, you can't actually see the resource type here, but you could just click in and boom, change the resource type. And before you know it, it could change the, uh, the on-screen um, filtering, for example. So um, yeah, lots you can do. It'd be really good is for rich text. So we have something made earlier, which is the podcast. Okay, so let's go in and have a look at a podcast. So we have Anna Ross. And in this here, what we've got is a rich text block. And what I might want to do is actually change something in here. So what I've done, I've actually spotted that it says see her, and I think R now is actually a he. So all we have to do is double click. Bob's your uncle, off to the races, and we've changed it. Imagine, look how quick that was. Now, can I undo that? I can't actually undo it, which is interesting. Control Z, maybe I can undo it here. Interestingly, yeah, I can't undo what, what's been changed there. So the normal way would be go into the CMS, go into here, have a look in here, boom, 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 and save it. So yeah, so as you can see, it's much quicker to do it. There's changed again. I could even go in here and click here, and maybe I do it that way. So, but yeah, doing the on um, on canvas is much easier. There's a, a few things like yeah, you can't undo, and you don't. Has it been saved? So you you just got to be careful, but. Um, yeah, brilliant new feature, um, and give it a go. We will be rolling out, well, I say we will be, it's rolled out to all the clients, and we'll be introducing them to all our clients, past and present, just to make sure that they know now that they can do this, because this will be super efficient for their marketing and, and copywriting teams.